Hey you guys, this is Caitlin, Caitlin Sherelle, whatever you want to call me, you know. And I am back to you guys with a review on this beautiful hair. Ignore that string. I I don't have any scissors with me right now to cut it, but yeah. I'm here today to review this beautiful hair. It is the Jenny Collection. It is Gabrielle and it's in a color 1B. But yeah, so it's an extremely deep Swiss pe Swiss lace wig. It's heat resistant up to 360 degrees. It is like I said, it is a color 1B. The name is Gabrielle. Some other colors that it does come in is 11B, 2FS, 1B, 1B30, OET, 1B27, OET, 1B30, OET, 1B Burgundy, Mocha Blonde, Choco, Choco Blonde violet blue and golden blonde so those are some other colors that it does come in if you do need or want other color options those are definitely some other colors and this is the stock card and on the stock card the girl is wearing the color golden blonde so if you like this color if this is something that's your vibe then you can of course purchase the golden blonde it's really nice um general care instruction from premium heat resistant fiber the following is the general outline for how to maintain premium heat resistant fiber always wash hair in cold water using mild shampoo or conditioner washing hair in hot water will damage fibers never scrub hair swish it gently from side to side and duck it up and down use a towel and pat dry never brush or comb hair when wet never use blow dryer if in rush use cold settings on the dryer if necessary, detangle hair with a wide tooth comb, working from bottom of the hair to the top. If the hair gets frizzy, use sheen spray, then comb. You can resume styling once hair is completely dry. Never comb or brush hair. Brush spiral curls or dreadlocks. Use finger comb gently. Hair may tangle if general hair instructions are not following perfect, properly. And so, yes, those are all the dis um, instructions they do give you or the advice they do give you to maintain this hair. Okay, now on my opinion about this hair, what was the ranking? First is longevity, I believe. Longevity is how long do I think this hair will last? I think this hair could last. Um, Because you're able to wash it and like you can put heat to it and... You can manipulate it. I do feel like it can work. Granted, I do feel like this is a wig that if you do want it a long period of time, this would be a wig that you would or you might have to like just trim and cut a little bit just to cut the little frizzies off to make it look more presentable or in your opinion what presentable might be. So that might be the only thing that I can think of. But I do see it lasting a good amount of time. It's just, you know, your maintenance. You know, that's like with virgin hair. How you maintain the hair is determining factor of if the hair will last or not. So, it's the same thing with synthetic hair. Especially this hair. This hair is a nicer or premium fiber. So, you can have it last a little longer than your average synthetic wig. So, boom. So, secondly, I think the second one was... Ugh, fudge, I should have wrote this down. Give me a second. Okay, so two. Texture. All right, so texture, this text, first off, the curl pattern of this look. I don't know if y'all can see it. This curl pattern is beautiful. Like, this is beautiful. This look like if I was to wand curl some virgin hair, honestly. So, yeah, like, I really love that. Like, I very much love that. And... Shedding, okay, let me just, right, let me act like I'm just, or not act like it. Let me detangle one side and I can show y'all how much it sheds. Just from doing that, give me a second. This should, the top part always gets a little tangled.
Okay, so we're just doing all of that, just not on this side of my hair. This is how much hair, you can't see. That's how much hair shedding. So I don't think that's that bad, honestly, and truly. So yeah, so tangling is not bad. The curl pattern is beautiful. Shedding, not that bad. But um, the overall texture is beautiful. Like it's a very soft, like lightweight wig. Like this is a very soft and lightweight. I very much love that about this. I love that for me. And yeah, that is texture. So that, like I said, that is how much hair came off. And yeah. So next three is ease. Like, is this able to? Is this a go? Put, throw on and go type of wig. So I definitely do think this is a throw on go. I do think the f top needs to be flattened some. I said I was gonna try with like my curling wand to like flatten it a little bit. The top. I'm gonna put some concealer in because this. Actually, has a really nice um laced way it's made, so I would wear this without the headband. I just do the headband on, just cause this is like an easier look. It looks you look put together. So yeah, ease is very easy. I don't even have clips in. I usually don't put clips in when I put my wigs on, just because it's just clips do damage your hair, just like glue damages your hair. But you know, I ain't about to knock nobody that does that either or, but me. Don't want to put glue. Don't want to put um the combs in my hair. So yeah, the combs are not in. But it still is like a very much a throw on and go type of wig. So yes, there is that. And for just my overall opinion, and would I purchase this wig again? Do I recommend this wig? Just my overall opinion. So my overall opinion, I do give this wig um I'll say 4.5 out of 5. 4.5 out of 5. I don't know what's not keeping me at 5. Maybe it's the shedding. I don't like shedding. Or maybe it's like the tangling or how like it kind of does look wiggy. But nonetheless, I do definitely give this a 4 out of 5. 4.5 out of 5. It's an amazing wig. Definitely recommend Definitely think this is a cute wig that you can wear. It's so like I said, with the, with the last of you, throw on and go errands, things like that. Like, cause you know, even though a lot of us are still in the house, a lot of us do are in the house more frequently because of the current life events. You do not want to, in a sense, like not look your part. Like you should still be looking cute walking around your apartment because at the end of that walk around your apartment, your house, your house that you share with somebody, who cares? You should still feel beautiful when you're walking around your house. And not saying I don't feel beautiful with my braids, but you know, it's okay to get spruced a little bit. So I definitely think this is a wig that you should throw on and go. This is a wig you can wear around the house. Things of that nature. So yeah, perfect. So yeah, rating. I did the brand. I said 4.5 out of 5. So, yeah. Like always, if you do have any more questions, you're welcome to DM me or comment down below. And I am more than welcome to respond. And, you know, we can chat. So, <laughs> if you have any questions, like I said, comment down below. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much and you have a great rest of your day.